Hi legends, welcome back. We are here for the final Has Been Hotel reaction. This is me finally watching the pilot episode because when I first started the show, I didn't know there was a pilot episode on YouTube. So we're checking that one out today and I'm quite excited to be able to like compare the two because having seen all of the show, it's gonna be interesting now to jump back into the pilot episode and see what started this all. So we're gonna do that. If you wanna see the complete full length episode by episode reactions to this show, they are available down below on my Patreon. Each and every episode is up on there and we are now starting Hell of a Boss. So if you want to watch that, that is also up on my Patreon and it will be up on YouTube in the coming weeks. And feel free to subscribe because I'm really excited that we're getting so close to 70k and it's all because of you so thank you so much. So if more of you want to join would be highly appreciated. And we have my socials which is just Instagram now because I have Twitter but I kind of deleted it because I don't want to have anything to do with Twitter anymore but Instagram, Instagram is there and I enjoy it and I post about stuff At the end Ooh. Of the rain. Didn't it start like this? Like the actual show? Oh, her voice is beautiful but I don't think it's the same girly we have in the actual show that's the first thing I'm noticing I love the, the sound in the soundtrack of like fire burning because of hell. Wonder if it could be me. Okay, pause. We're only like a minute in and the first thing I'm noticing is that so far this pilot started off to a much creepier edge and scarier edge than the like first episode of Husband Hotel on Amazon Prime. This one's like kind of Got it. <laughs> this song is beautiful though. Like we might have to put this on the playlist. Oh my girly big hands. Oh my God, I love the cannibals. Yes, the cannibals, I missed them already. Wait, I love how they're showing everything in the first like two minutes here. Where's Alistair? I mean, was that him on the building? Okay, they kept the logo the same. We love that. If anything, it's just like a bit more yassified on Amazon, but no, it's really good. <laughs> Thanks for the fun time, hot stuff. Oh my ah! God! Voice actor for Angel sounds the same. Look. Not saying I'd be a druggie, but if my name was Angel and there was a drug called Angel Dust, why not? <gasps> Serpentious! <gasps> Serpentious! Oh, I miss him so much already! Rest in peace, you legend! No other okay, so another different voice actor now. Also, are the eggs numbered in the show? Because I don't think they are. But I actually quite like the idea of them being numbered. <laughs> Cherry Bomb? This is kind of exciting because this feels like cameo after cameo. And obviously it's not because this is the pilot. Oh, not the eggs. She put a bomb in the egg. That's evil, even on like hell's terms. That's her brand new passion project. All that and more. Bruh, the lines down at the bottom there are wild. Wait, yes. what's her name? Oh my god, oh my god, there's it. Charlie and Vaggy, how could I forget Vaggy? How did I forget the icon? The Vagisaurus. And you can put that away. I don't touch the gays. I have standards. I don't touch the gays. She's a homophobe. Oh my god, I did not expect that. You're not here because we wanted you here. Also, you're here. That was. That was just a bit of a. What's called inappropriate place to touch. So don't get cute with me, honey, or I will scare you. Every line. Welcome back. Go, so, Charlotte. It's Charlie. Look, Whatever. she may be a bitch, but she is good at her job. The way she snapped back on ready for camera could never. Well. <laughs> but still, she's working on live TV. She's got it down. Like that emotion switch from I'm going to kill you to welcome back to the news. Talent. Go give it where it's due. Good and everything around me. Ooh. Hell is my home and you are my people. 
Not the splashback. Drilling. Miss Gully, close your mouth. You're catching flies. That looks like the Mandy from the Hell of a Boss down in the well, corner. Blitzo. Hotel that rehabilitates sinners. Mm, the yeah, silence. Hotels are for people. No one here a fan of hotels? I love hotels. <gasps> Alice! Alice is eating this up though. <gasps> Tangled who? Ooh, the harmonies. Fifth harmony could never. On a chipmunkification of it. That was shit. <laughs> hmm. That's so mean. It was not. They're all haters. As Lady Gaga once said, There can be a hundred people in the room and 99 don't believe in you and you just need one to believe in you. And that was him, so. And who might that be? Oh, just someone named. Angel Dust. Oh. We are receiving word that a new player has entered the ongoing turf. It's gonna be Angel. <laughs> oh shit. Oh, oh shit. Poor Charlie. Tell us, how does it feel to be such a total failure? <laughs> That's so mean. Does it feel that I got your pen, huh? You shove it up her ass. Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> The woman was too stunned to speak. She grew like a full spider. She was giving other mother from Coraline. Oh, harder, Daddy. Son. <laughs> the bottom. Mm. <gasps> I just realized there's so many dead eggs in the background. That's so sad. That's so tragic. Rest in peace, the eggs. Oh, they're going for a WWE takedown. That was so epic. I love I love the chaos. And I already missed this show. I'm ready for season two. Made you look uh, sad. <clears throat> Pathetic. Like an orphan with no arms or legs. <gasps> he doesn't need to keep digging this grave. Don't get your taco in a twist, baby. Was that you trying to be sexist or racist? Whatever <clears throat> you more. Wow, Angel was a menace in this first pilot episode. I didn't realize they got the chompers on that limousine. Now that's a design. That's an epic limousine. Limos are like kind of lame these days, but one like that? That's gonna be my home. It's got some chompers. Good idea to get some actual food in this place. You know, to feed all the wayward souls you got in here. <laughs> oh my god, Angel does not need to keep hitting it where it hurts. Wait, does Mumsy actually pull through? Because we know in the show, mm-mm, mm-mm. I know I keep calling. Oh, okay, she didn't pull yes. through because she's uh, not picking up. I don't know if I'm going to make a difference. I don't know what I'm doing. Oh. I love you. Bye. Oh. Charlie deserves better. And I'm so glad in the show it does go better for her because she's so adorable. She's such a fluffy little character. All she wants is the best. <laughs> Oh, the but he's getting creepy. Oh. <laughs> oh, don't let him in. No, but he's slay. May I speak now? You may. Alice, a pleasure. And I just couldn't resist. What a oh, I love the creepy old timey music he's got with him right now, like his motif. I'm not gonna let you hurt anyone here, you pompous, cheesy talk show shit lord. Shit lord. <laughs> got him with that I one. I would have done so already. Oh, I know you guys know that I love those moments, but I really love those moments, and I wish they'd let them, like, last longer, even though they already hold them for a hot second. But I'd love an episode where it's just, like, in that kind of vibe. Like, I'd actually love it if they explored having a really, really, really creepy episode where it's just got that kind of atmosphere going. How it's, like, really unsettling, horrifying, creepy, a little bit sinister... I want them to go there. Don't be scared to scare us. Backing focus. Aimless. I want to add this score to my playlist. That's what I want to do. I want to watch the scum of the world struggle to climb up the hill of betterment. Only to repeatedly trip and tumble down to the fiery pit of failure. <laughs> I'm here for his ideas. 
Like, yes, watch everyone suffer. The radio demon, one of the most powerful beings hell has ever seen. Most powerful being? Ooh, we're getting his backstory? This artistry. Sinner started calling him the radio demon. This is all so stunning, it looks so good. And a violent monster of chaos, the likes of which we can't risk getting involved with unless we want to end up embraced. I want to put that back again because I'm pausing there. I want to rewatch that because I didn't process any of it because I was just so stunned by how cool it looked. It just kind of took my breath away. So we're going to go back. I'm actually going to listen to what they were saying and process it. I could rewatch this whole bit again and 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 again. Like, are you kidding me? Look at that. That kind of raw power. Focus, stop being so jaw dropped. Source of danger, a wicked spirit of mystery, and a violent monster of chaos, the likes of which. Pause. They call him like the unpredictable man. I still think he's misunderstood. I could fix him. I just think deep, 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 deep down, Alistair does care about the hotel. And people, like, even after seeing the whole show, I still stand by that. Somewhere deep down, he cares. So the rest of you are haters for telling me that he's manipulating me. No, he's not. I refuse. Do you trust any man? Any men? <laughs> men. Go boss, go slay. I'm not having anything wrong with that. She's going to live a long life. Ironically, I know she's in hell, but still, I support that. I support her message. I support her life. Leehood, I support her life choices. They trust a man. Yeah, yeah. This is to give people a chance. Oh, Lilith in that photo. Do not make a deal with him. Don't worry. I picked up one thing from my dad. You don't take shit from other demons. Although, that hasn't aged very well now, has it? So it's a deal then. Mm. Wait, so we have two deals technically of Alistair? No shaking, no deals. Aye. <laughs> As princess of hell and heir to the throne. Oh, that's when they dropped the little knowledge that she's princess of hell. I was wondering when they were going to say that, but it's interesting to see that she didn't make a deal with him now, but she gets desperate enough later that she does. Suppose I can cash in a few favours to liven things up. Hus. Hus. It's nifty! This little darling is nifty! Read them and weep, boys. Hus! Hell? What the fuck is this? What, you think you can buy me with a wink and some cheap booze? Not wrong. <laughs> hey, hey. Go f yourself. Only if you watch me. Oh my gosh. I don't know why I'm so shocked. That's like one of the least vulgar things Angel has said. What the hell? This should remind me a bit of their musical number in the Cannibal Town in episode 7 or 8. Of every demon is a lost cause. <laughs> okay. You know what I'm gonna say? It's going on the playlist. Serpentious. Serpentious! Because we also had this happen in episode one or two. Is that Alistair taking control? Slay, but did he? Did he eliminate Serpentius in the first episode? Because not having that happy hotel. Now, stay tuned. That was really cool to finally watch the actual pilot episode of the show i like to see the differences and the similarities and things they definitely were like hey let's take a bit of that and put it into one of the episodes so that was really cool i actually preferred watching the pilot episode after seeing the whole show and i think going forward i would recommend people do the same 
because that was so fun to like have finished the show and then have this extra episode to go back to watch and compare and just see some of my favorite characters again so i don't know i mean obviously i I haven't had the experience of watching the pilot episode first and then the tv show so i don't know what that'd be like but i think it was way more fun to go back because if i watched the first one and then saw some of the stuff that happens later on in the show I wouldn't be confused, but like the whole thing with Serpentius as well, because Serpentius got eliminated at the end there, and then to see him show up in the very same manner, I'd be like, oh, we've seen this. But this time around, it was like really cool to see it again, and where inspiration was taken. But anyway, that's enough from me. I really enjoyed that. That was so nice, getting to jump into the has Hotel world again. And I'm so excited that we started Hell of a Boss. That's very exciting to me, if you didn't know. Let me know if you were the same as me and you watched the show on Amazon first and then the pilot episode or were you the majority of people where you've seen the pilot episode first and then you watch the TV show. Curious to know. But yeah, if you like this, you might like one of these videos, so feel free to check them out. I could put up the first Hasbro Hotel reaction for you to check it up here in case you missed out on that. And maybe Hell of a Boss down here, because clearly if you like this, you probably like this. So yeah, I'll leave it up to you and I'll see you next time. Bye!